this place in Glastonbury is truly wonderful. I remember coming to this area as a child, being taken up to Glastonbury tour by my mum and dad, and I thought what a magical area it is, because there's something very special about it. It's a place where people come together and they achieve things. I want to say thank you to Michael for lending us his farm, for giving the space all those years ago for people to come here, enjoy music, enjoy good company, and enjoy inspiring thought. Michael, you paved the way for the space for all of us. Because what festivals are about, what this festival is about, is about coming together. This festival was envisaged as being for music, yes, but also for environment and for peace. When people across the world think the same, cooperate the same, maybe in different languages, in different faiths, in different cultures, peace is possible and must be achieved. And so we have this space this weekend here. We have this space in our communities to organize and create, to develop a stronger, better economy, to protect our planet, to have a better approach to human rights, to have a real approach to social justice and a real issue about the redistribution of power and wealth within our society. So I simply say to the Prime Minister, if she's got time this afternoon to be watching Glastonbury, we're ready for another election as soon as you like. We do it for those who went before and we do it for those to come afterwards. Let's do it above all together. Thank you very much. <laughs>